Anyway, Magic Mike. Yep, yep. Now, um, let's establish that your favourite Star Wars film is... And don't say Rogue One or I'll leave this table. <laughs> Rogue Two. What? Oh, is that, that, is that a thing? No. No. But if there is no. Rogue One, there have to be Rogue Two. You know when you come uh, from a role-playing game society mm -hmm. and there is Rogue One, mm -hmm. then you will be Rogue Two. Look, uh, look who, ju just look who just, just have, have, have a look over your shoulder. Oh. Indeed. So Remco, Remco, the Flying Dutchman has arrived with the double lightsaber, which is the most wonderful what? Uh, double? object. What double? Oh. Remco, I would, I would, uh, I would argue this could be the perfect, like, uh, what's the word in movies? A MacGuffin. Perhaps. A MacGuffin. This would be the. I would chase down a quest to get this thing. What have you discussed, first of all? Many oh, things, Remco. actually, already. Ma oh, come on, Ma 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 let, me, let, me, let me just be a host here and say, uh, welcome to Hofcast. Uh, we've, this is the pilot episode, and we decided... It's we, made on voyage. Would you, would you agree that we are three comedians? We are kind of three comedians. Ka ka yeah. Kinda, kinda. I kinda. think we are three comedians. Did we not take but, the but, stage but, last but, week? But we are definitely three Star Wars hardcore diehard fans. And we have the lightsaber here. And we the have a really S. big lightsaber here. You can see it at Hof House when now, you come by. We have, uh, <laughs> let me introduce Remco. Remco, uh, you're a, a Dutch man living in Budapest who's a gamer and a bit of a classy dresser. Yes. Favorite Star Wars film? Quickly, off the top of your head. But Don't Windsor is it. not his way. Come on, what is it? Favorite, Star, favorite Star Wars movie is what? Uh, that will always be the um, Empire, 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 okay, Empire Strikes, Empire Strikes, Empire Strikes Back, yeah. Back. And then we have uh, Magic Mike, who I call IMD Mike, who likes to be called Mike, just Mike. <laughs> yes. and Magic Mike is fine. Ma and your favorite? That, that, that's the nearest thing I get uh, close to Channing Tatum. <laughs> <laughs> what's, uh, what's your favorite Star Wars film? Revenge of the Sith. What's your favorite Star Wars film? Revenge of the Sith. Oh, don't tell me. Oh, that. actually, I, I, I might, not. I might, I, I'm going to correct myself. I actually agree with you. No, <laughs> don't tell me that. Yeah, oh, yeah. I'm, I'm, leaving. I'm, I'm, I'm going to leave. Vader's, that's, that's Vader's, actually... Vader's force uh, scream with crash uh, at the end is epic. No, it's not epic. It's so bad. The no at the end makes my skin crawl. It is so bad. Don't you get it? Uh, it's Do you guys uh, not see how bad and cringy it is? It, it is a bit cringy, but the, 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 but if, if it's you, mocked. But if, if you look at the details, you can see Palpatine laughing in the corner. Yes, that makes it yes. great. Yes, Palpatine's actually already knowing what he's doing, and I'll he's already laughing. Yes, yeah, My yeah, favorite yeah, yes. character in the prequels is Palpatine. Every epic Palpatine is he's amazing. He's always having fun, throwing things around, but. Can I throw something out there? My, my they, shouldn't, Jar Jar. they shouldn't reboot. No, you don't, you're not telling me Jar Jar, no? Yeah. <laughs> Jar Jar? Yeah. They shouldn't reboot Deep the original Star Wars. They should reboot the prequels. Wait. And I wrote a script to do wait, it. Wait, wait, wait. Mic drop. I didn't finish. My favorite is Jar Jar. Deep fried on a plate with french fries. <laughs> he, would, he would be uh, crumbed as well, like an octopus, I'd say. Like a, like calamari, if you had to serve up. Uh, if you have, <laughs> if you have enough hot sauce, and when whatever. You, and, and every time you take a bite, you hit misa. Misa. <laughs> misa wanna drink and misa wanna fight. You, you, you know that that uh, people hated George R. Ben so I will, much I, that they I will be, put him back in the second yeah. movie. I, I, yeah. I will, I will oh, be, I will man. be the greatest took, supply supplier of hot the, sauce to Naboo. Question: Was he even in the third film? Yes, but uh, he was sidelined totally. He was sidelined, totally. side and he, did he have a line in the third film? He got I think, a shot, I, I, I think, do believe I, I, he had I think a shot when, at the funeral. I think, I think when, uh, he didn't say a when line, Anakin though. visited uh, Padme in one of the earlier scenes, uh, he, uh, he said something like... Uh, Misa upset that I not have any line in movie. <laughs> <laughs> You know what would be the best yeah. thing? Dar Jar Jar. That would be the Oh, good. this theory that, of that, it. That, 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 would, that, would be that, that, that would be hard. It was Palpatine or somehow. Uh, Dar Jar Jar. That Jar Jar would be, that was would be the real Dar Jar becomes Sith Lord. Yeah. <laughs> no, honestly, should they, let's go back not. on topic. Should Dooku, they reboot Dooku, the original Dooku. or not? Should they reboot the original Star Wars? So you mean the, the original movies? Episode A New Hope, Empire Strikes Back, Last Jedi. Should or they start from the scratch? You mean Return of the Jedi? 
everything. Should they start from scratch, put everything under the Disney era, still be Disney, but reboot them? Wait, okay, I'm talking about in like 15, 20 actually, years. Actually, actually, I disagree with uh, uh, Disney. Uh, Disney is, 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 is watering the thing up. They what? Watering it up. Watering it up? Yeah. Uh, what do you mean by that? Uh, uh, when you pour beer and you put water in it ah, to diluting lighten it, it diluting dilute, it diluting it lighten yeah dilute, absolutely dilute. absolutely especially yeah. when they, once they turned to TV they did yes 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 now they should have stuck to because these TV series we're watching they were films the, uh, they were supposed to be the films the, the only the, to be the, a the only film. the, the only to be a, uh, tough and uh, really uh, good movie in this era was the one that you Hate and despise the most, Rogue One. I don't hate and despise it the most. I hate and despise the Obi Wan series number one, um, the uh, Acolyte. I haven't even watched because I just gave up Acolyte. on Star Wars. I hate that. Did you watch it? Yeah, the Acolyte is something that I even uh, I didn't even start. In. And I think here comes. Did you the, start and end it? Uh, no, I didn't start. See, it, me no. neither. Uh, I, there's a really funny YouTube channel. What a sad day. There's a really funny. Hungarians, uh, Hungarians used to translate really good, but. With the acolyte, they just simply mirrored it with the effectively Latin acolyte. The Hungarian perspective is interesting, but what were you saying? Okay, so I think the, the biggest problem with Disney Star Wars, and I think you will agree with me, uh, there's something called woke culture. What? Vogue culture. Vogue culture. Yeah. Stay, oh, woke. Stay, stay woke. awake. Oh, yeah. No, yeah. You know, okay. the message. The message. I don't, no. and, don't and, listen. And, and, and Disney wants the message in Star Wars. Are you quoting Critical Drinker? I am kind of because I, I agree. Hate that kind, I, honestly, I, 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 I agree with some of what he says, but he's I, fucking, he's such a dumbass. Anyway, do, yeah, do, yeah. Do, but do I, I do agree that the woke nature do is I, too, do, too much. It started with the Last Jedi. Do I recall? It started with the Last Jedi. Hey guys. Do yeah. I recall it right uh, that uh, in Acolyte uh, there is Ken Jeong? Who? Uh, the dude with the long head? Uh, no, uh, a Chinese guy. Oh yeah, the guy from... Um, uh, Hangover. Oh, Hangover? I think he is. No, the, the main actor is the Korean actor who's in the, the, the TV series about the TV show where they have to... Kill each other, blah blah blah. Uh, Hunger Games, not Hunger Games. Fuck. Come on. What's that Korean TV series that was very popular last year? Uh, Squid oh, Game. Um, Squid Game. Squid Game. He was Squid the Game, main yeah. character in Squid Game, and he didn't even know English. He learned English from the script. Okay, that he was so given. that's not Kang Jeong. No, because Kang Jeong's be, from the be, Hangover. Beca 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 because Kang Jeong is a great comedian, a great uh, uh, comedic actor, but uh, yes, see, yes. See, seeing him. Neo Jedi, oh, please not. Oh, no, no, please no. Um, when the, the, the other thing I don't want to see uh, near a Star Wars uh, setting is Dwayne Johnson. Sally, Sally. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, I, I totally he's, agree. He, he's a so great in action movies. He's a likable person, but nowhere near Star Wars. Ones. Please. Yeah, no, 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 absolutely. I mean, we'll see. I, I, what I would like to see, I mean, it's it, it's very difficult to predict the future of Star Wars at this point. Yes. Um, because the, the, the only thing sorry, we I missed that. I was the, the, out. What, what did you say? Uh, it's very difficult to predict the future of Star Wars. At the the only thing we can predict that's why I think that, that there will this. be there, there will be at, le at least twenty movies from here. No, Kathleen Kennedy is about to leave, and when she does, this is going to happen. But you know what? I think yeah, they yeah, shouldn't the, do this. Yeah, yeah this is going to happen. Do, they should do a reboot of the prequels, not this. This, this, this will happen. You and think then, so? Yes, and then, absolutely. And then the other, then the other, and the Can other. Can you hear me out, Mike? I wrote a yeah. script, right, for episode one, rebooted, and I did this for fun, fan fiction. Kill I used that to do script writing. bald old Are you man. Listen to me? Who is the counselor? <laughs> okay, so you're if, a peach. <laughs> so, so, so if, if we do, okay, so if, let's get. Let's Let get, me let's, just. Can I? Can I explain yeah, my idea? Indeed. Yeah, yeah. Now, Go for it. I want Go your approval on it. So yeah. the first film opens up with a a scene where a very stealthy Sith, basically, kind of like you know the opening scene in um, Dark Knight Rises. Yeah. With Bane. Yeah. Oh, dark, that yeah, kind of Bane. scene in space with a Sith Lord working alone who looks female. First. 
Female. Yes. Now, that's, oh, what, no, that's, what, we go that's, again. that's my listen, problem. Let, can I, we, we, stop, we didn't, stop, 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 hear sorry. me out for a second. We didn't, we didn't, uh, uh, comic books. There this is not so a woke thing. I'm not. I'm not making this a woke thing. Hear yeah. me out now. So, so good female uh, Sith characters. Basically, Padme's character should have been a Sith Lord. That's Why not? My, my prequel. That's what my prequel idea is. Because Anakin falls in love with this with the the apprentice, not the Sith Lord, the apprentice of Palpatine, which is this Padme character who wears a helmet the whole time. You know it's a girl, but you don't know their face. And Anakin is not a kid in the movie. Ben Kenobi crash lands on this fucking and Natalie on this can junk planet and, finds, the, and finds this 22-year-old Anakin Skywalker who races pods but in this junk planet with his family, brothers 22? and sisters, 12. and 12. A, a, 12. a plot 12. Evolving the, involving the planet and the Empire puts Ben Kenobi and and you know who I would who I would cast as Empire Anakin. Listen Republic. to me. Republic. Republic. No, you know who I would hire to act as Anakin Skywalker as a 22 year old, maybe with some CGI. I think Liam fucking Neeson. <laughs> okay. may, may, maybe some CGI, a major CGI. He should have been. Anakin Skywalker, that's the biggest joke. The okay, biggest so joke is they miscast him. And they miscast the whole thing. This the prequel should be rebooted and it would be brilliant. And it would match the original so much better. Mm. Trust me. Uh, <laughs> Liam Neeson as Anakin Skywalker. A young Liam Neeson, Look maybe. Look how tall he is. He has the movement. He has the figure. He, he has, has everything. The he has he has everything, but she's more and everything. Not Hayden fucking Christensen and not some kid. You start the story with Anakin already a bit older and you watch the corruption happen over maybe 10 years. So, so, so already an established uh, Padres winner. A champion. No, he's, they do, you know, have you seen that video game um, Wipeout? Yeah. Have you seen I the, played Wipeout for the first time on my PlayStation 1. Me too. Have you seen the Nintendo Wipeout game me. Extreme G? Uh, it's no. like a motorcycle version of Wipeout. No one really played it. You had to be a Nintendo guy. Anyway, episode they Warrior, do sir. The, the Wipeout type pod uh -oh. racing. Hey Not guys. the stupid in the desert. Hey in guys. the jump episode tunnel, Warrior, they go sir. in tunnels, they go like this, and it's a great scene, have and Obi-Wan's involved in it somehow. Hey guys, have you, you played read Episode it. 1 Racer? Sorry? Star Wars Episode 1 Racer. That's a pod race game. Oh, I actually played that though as a kid. Ah, oh, the Nintendo one? No, the PC one. I played the PC one. I also played Naboo Starfighter. Wait, are you talking about the Shadow <laughs> of the Empire? I did all the way. Are you talking about Shadow of the Empire? No. What are you? Which Episode game are you talking one, about? Racer. Yeah, it's I just a pod racing game. On Nintendo, I played it. Nintendo yeah. 64. It was really good. Yes. Yeah, that, I mean there were many funny. And uh, it was really hard. Cube uh, uh, levels. Uh, Zero G levels, crash on everything. The thing is that the Nintendo 64 at that time had this system where it was not as good graphically as the PlayStation, but they would hide it with the fog. You know, you remember Turok, the video game Turok? Yeah, 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 and yeah, you, yeah. And you couldn't see more than like five feet ahead oh, of you. Oh, that's all missed. Uh, now you're that's what that racer was like. You can own, you can see things. <laughs> but, now, but now you're talking some real nostalgia here, okay? Nope, so yeah, I, I, I remember uh, there was... We, we are old school, old old school gamers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm an old... I'm, Jedi Academy. I'm still an old school... Racer. I'm still an old school gamer. Uh, I remember this this game... I, I, I hate the new school gamers. PvP is everything. I want to kill everyone. Yeah, but you had this game, I remember. It was a Star Wars game and it was so hard, I've never beaten it. What was it? I watched a few guys trying to play it on... on, oh, on the Yeah, it was called Rebel Assault 2. Oh. And Rebel geez, Assault, it was that was um, hard as hell. It was unforgiving. Really? One it, shot, it, one It kill? was so unforgiving. And uh, Rebel Assault, uh, I think uh, that was... Just watch the beer. Uh, this, uh, the, uh, yeah, yeah, I know. That I was know. the cinematic uh, game. Right? Guys, I've got to take out for a sec. Continue, please. Oh, yeah. Hi. Uh, yeah, no, was that was the cinematic uh, game. Yeah. I've never seen Star Wars. Oh, my God, did you hear that? You've oh, never I'm seen Star Wars. Well, you have it right here. I'm 